What's this? Chinese. Oh, but I wanted Mexican. I had Mexican last night. It's really good, actually. Can't believe I've barely experienced the greatness of albatross. You've eaten an albatross? You sick fuck. Oh, oh, the restaurant, not the bird. Oh. So, what do you have for patrols? Well, from checking out for the past few weeks, looks like every Friday and Saturday, Guard 8 is a few minutes late, but Guard 7 doesn't stick around past the end of his shift. What's a few minutes? Average is six. <clears throat> should be plenty. Well, we'll see if your gap theory holds up today. And if it does, we should be good for tomorrow. Should I round up the crew? Yeah, make the call. And now that I think about it, if Albatross tastes anything like duck, it could be kind of good. So firm. This is the side of the target, the Nate Hable Lecture Hall. There isn't actually much security on the inside, so the problem is just getting near the building. Scott and I did some recon, and we found that there's a six minute gap in the security guard change. Unfortunately, the patrol path of the other guards on campus is much tighter. Luckily, there's an old tunnel system directly below campus that's not well known and it's unguarded. I can access it from here and arrive at this spot. Now the first obstacle is a system of security cameras. We're going with the old fashioned video loop. We don't want to rely on the loop to mask us for too long, just enough to get us in and out of the area. Hacking into the security system's video feed isn't so simple either. The university's security system is powered independently and sustained on-site and off the grid. So the only way to access the video feed is through an on-campus computer. But there's more. In order to get into the network, I'm going to need a momentary gap in the security's defenses. Matt's cooked up a device that'll drop the defense measures long enough for him to set up the loop. But the device needs to be planted on the central security defense hub, which is located in the science library. Scott, you're going to plant the device on the hub when we're in position. Retrieve the device once Jeannie and I are out. Roger that. Next is getting in. The doors open only to a keycard. The keycards are non-replicable and recoded every 12 hours. So you're going to have to swipe one off and drive the data. Well, I guess that's where I come in. Just look at his hands like the West Coast. <laughs> Speaking from experience. <clears throat> She's a new hire and probably doesn't know what the keycard actually does. So, you're going to take this dummy card and do a little switch. Well, I can't just walk up to her and just swipe the card. You're right. So you're going to need a diversion. You've got to be kidding me. He would be the most qualified for this target. <clears throat> Scott will keep her busy and you'll switch the card. Simple as that. Once we have the card, I'll use it to enter the building that night. Jeannie will be with me to keep lookout in case there are any sudden changes in guard movements. Any questions? Good. Now get some sleep. Tomorrow's going to be a long day. Like, I know, right? I can't believe she would do that. Come on, Scott. Where's your diversion? Hey, you! Stop! Stop! Oh my gosh, I almost got run over by a stupid biker. Excuse me. Hey, stop! Just what do you think you're doing? I know, I'm really sorry. Sorry doesn't cut it. You know, officer, it, it's my first offense, and, and you seem very pretty. I mean, pretty reasonable. All right, I'll let you off with a warning. But I better not catch you riding your bike on the road again. Oh, most definitely not. Thank you so much, officer. Um, excuse me. Uh, you, know, you know, it's the funniest thing. I actually saw you as I got onto the road, and I should have gotten off, but I guess I was just a little distracted. <laughs> You know you've already gotten yourself out of the ticket. Oh, I know, I know, but I'm just saying, if they keep hiring officers as pretty as you are, I'm gonna have to ride my bike more often just to be stopped by you guys. Um, excuse me. Um, you like dropped your keycard thing. Thank you. Well, I better get back to my route. You stay out of trouble. Oh, I will. See, that's exactly what I'm talking about. I had to! You're such a pig. Everything goes smoothly? Smooth enough. <laughs>